What is up guys? How are you doing today? I've been seeing a lot of these videos and a lot of you guys have been asking what are my favorite apps? What do I edit with? What are my favorite games? What's like my favorite new apps? So I decided to take you guys on a journey through my phone. Who knows what we're gonna find? Could be anything at this point. But I got my phone right here so I'm going to show you what is on my iPhone 6 Plus. I'm scared. Let's get into it, shall we? All right, you can see my lock screen right here. It's a picture that I took with my drone in, I think it was like Laguna Cliffs or something like that. But I took it with the drone. You can see some surfers there at the bottom. I thought it was some good vibes. My family was in town, so me and my family are on the beach over there. Let's open this bad boy up, shall we? Okay, so you can see I have like a good amount of apps, some folders, all that stuff. So let's get into it. Okay, so you can see like like all of my folders, they don't have any names, they just have little emojis. And so those emojis kind of like encapsulate what's in that folder. So for example, this first one over here, um, yeah, it's a moth. Did you guys see that? I let it in accidentally earlier. I knew it'd come back and get me. The first one over here, uh, it has like mail, so you open it up. It's got my mail, it's got app store settings, bank, uh, Fandango, my wallet around me, all that stuff. I guess I'll tell you guys like a little bit about like some of the apps and stuff that around me. Like I just moved so I don't know like what's around me. So you click it, it shows you like all of the like things around you. Your restaurants, like gas stations, all that stuff. Fandango is new to me too. I got my movie ticket on it. They just like scanned my phone when I walked in, which was pretty cool. That's that folder. These are kind of like my like social media-ish stuff. We got you now, Vine. Uh, Facebook page. You got Facebook regular, Facebook Messenger, Musical.ly, Beam, Lively. Um, I haven't used Lively yet. Let me know if you guys use Lively in the comments below. I'm kind of on Musical.ly. Beam's really cool too. If you guys use any of these apps like throughout the whole video, let me know in the comments below. Then I have my camera stuff. So I have my camera, my photos, Facetune, uh, Boomerang is that one with Instagram where it goes like uh, Square Ready. I don't know why I have that anymore. That's when I used to put like borders on Instagram, no one does that anymore. Photoshop Fix, my Canon app. Whenever I take pictures or video like on this camera, I can download it straight to my phone. 1967, not too sure what that is. Let me like switch around for a second. There's this Journey app, this is like my new favorite app. I just like downloaded it recently and it's really, really cool, Journey. You can record for like 45 seconds, it's really cool, I'll just show you. So with it, you just push record, hey, what's up, yeah, what up, this is what I'm doing today. This is my journey, like, cool, la la la. So you record, you can put like a filter on it if you want. You put in a category of like what emotion that you're just talking about, so I'm happy, always. And then you can talk about like what you're talking about. I just confess something, and then you share it. It's actually really cool, I'm getting into it. I mean, if you want to follow me on it. <laughs> You know, you can. I love it, it's pretty interesting. So you guys should download the app. I'm gonna be using it a lot. I'll leave the links in the description below. Visco Cam I have like on the screen because I use that one a lot actually. This is what I usually use to like edit all my photos for Instagram. But you can see like some of my stuff in there. If you guys want me to like go through a full thing for just like Visco Cam on how I edit my photos, let me know in the comments below. They just like updated it, I don't like it. Uh, calendar, of course, that's where I like have everything. It's like packed right now and it's intense. I have music, so I have SoundCloud, Spotify, music, Amazon music. Okay, then over here I have Reminder, Safari, Dropbox, so I can send like files from my computer to my phone. iBooks, I actually do read iBooks. There's some good ones. Yeah. I know how to read. <laughs> followers Plus is pretty cool for Instagram. It kind of tells you like how many followers you're gaining or losing or who doesn't follow you back or who does follow you back. It's free, it's cool. Uh, Yelp, I've been using Yelp now that like I'm in a big city. I got YouTube, Maps, that's normal. The studio app to comment back to you guys if I'm not on my computer. I like to comment back, I do comment back. So I read what you guys say too. Or this movie folder right here, whoa. Netflix got a new logo. Didn't even notice that. But yeah, it's like Netflix, Hulu, Amazon Video, HBO Go, Awesomeness TV app, Go90, Allen Theaters. That's from like New Mexico. I don't think I need that anymore. Um, I got my GoPro app, so when I like set up my GoPro and stuff, I can see it on my phone. I can start stop it on my phone. Pretty cool. Starbucks actually pretty cool. You push it. And then you like, you can see the stars and move your phone around and they'll like tell you about the stars and stuff. I have a lot of like star stuff all over me, so I really like that app. I have Flappy Birds, people. You guys know Flappy Birds. I'm horrible at Flappy Birds. Are you guys good at Flappy Birds? Let me know in the comments below. I can't get past like two. 
Okay, on another page here, I have another new app that's called Funster. And this one's actually really cool, I love it. Let me show you how it works. So this app like helps you organize parties like within your friends. So everyone can get together, you can host different things. If you guys order food or a pizza or something, you can split payments within this app, which is really cool. You create an event. Let's say you and your friends wanna have a board game night, you just click board game night. I, I like to throw in some trash talk. Add some emojis for some flair. My favorite emoji right now is that nerd face one, it's funny. And of course you have to say when it is, 8 p.m. And then you can say like what you want your friends to bring. If you want someone to bring chips or drinks or any of that stuff. Let's say we want some Cokes, water. Let's have someone bring a cake. Yes. I had to put a place in there, so I just put Disneyland. Don't go throwing parties at Disneyland. Okay, so you create the event, then you invite your friends. Everyone gets together. They say what they can bring. It's like hanging out in 2016. So if you guys want to get this app, I'm going to leave the link down below. Use it. Create little things with your friends. It's awesome. Okay, the bleep app. You basically, with this, I just think it's funny. You can like record a video on it and then put bleeps on it too, so it's like you can bleep yourself, or what I do is I put bleeps on people when they don't even cuss, so it's like really funny. And maybe I'm just a child and it's not really funny, but I think it's great. I got the Apple Watch thing that just controls like stuff with my Apple Watch, uh, the remote for Apple TV, so I have that for the living room and the room, so I can control the Apple TV just from the phone, really cool. I have the hover app for my drone, so I can know where I cannot fly the drone or when it's safe to fly the drone, which, you know, don't wanna get arrested. And then DJI is my drone app, so I can see my drone when I fly it. But yeah, basically that's all the apps. And the ones down here, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, messages, basic, you guys know what those are. But yeah, so that's what's on my phone. I hope you guys liked it, that was kinda like weird looking at my phone. I never show anyone my phone. If you liked anything, let me know which one you liked. But yeah, this is cool. If you guys want to see how I edit my Instagram pictures, I will do that. Just let me know if you want it. <laughs> but thank you guys for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And be sure to subscribe to join the family if you are not subscribed. We want you. We want you in the family. But thank you guys for watching. Now I'll see you guys tomorrow.